factors affecting friction. Now let us learn about the various factors that affect the friction. The factors that affect the friction includes the condition of the surfaces in contact and the weight of an object. Friction is caused by the irregularities of the two surfaces in contact. The surfaces which appear very smooth also have a large number of minute irregularities on them and these irregularities on the two surfaces lock into one another. When we attempt to move any surface, we have to apply a force to overcome interlocking. A rough surface produces more friction compared to a smooth surface. For example, it is difficult to pull a heavy box along a woolen blanket than along a tiled surface. This is because of the greater frictional force produced by the woolen blanket due to its rough surface. We will slip when we step on a banana peel on the road due to the less friction between the banana peel and the surface of the road. Friction also depends on the weight of the object. It will be very difficult to push or pull a box of 50 kg when compared with a box of lesser weight. This is because heavier box exerts greater frictional force. We can also observe that the friction is caused by the interlocking of irregularities in the two surfaces. The force of friction increases if the two surfaces are pressed harder. For example, dragging a carpet is easy if nobody is sitting on it. And it will be hard to drag a carpet if a person is sitting on it. Friction is important in every moment of a life like walking on a road, holding a glass jar, writing on the book with a pen, writing on the blackboard with chalk, etc. We cannot stop a moving object if there is no friction. Without friction, we cannot construct buildings, we cannot stop the vehicles. On the other hand, friction wears out the materials like soles of shoes, clothes, screws, ball bearings, etc. Friction produces heat. For example, when we rub our two palms together for few minutes, we can feel the production of heat. Friction also results in the wastage of energy. So, friction is called as a necessary evil.